Foot Soldiers of Paleontology, a film about the modern-day Indiana Joneses of the paleontology world. Since the first dinosaur fossil discovery, the world has been fascinated with dinosaurs. Most fine without fine. 95% of all new fossil discoveries are made by the foot soldiers of paleontology. Call them dinosaur hunters, or fossil collectors, or amateur paleos. They are the modern day Indiana Joneses of the paleontology world. Adventure seekers, obsessed with fossils. Oh, that's how it fits. That's how it fits. Yeah. Both coracoids here, beautiful. Yep. Pretty good find, you never find whole animals. This film is about three of Australia's most prolific fossil foot soldiers. Fossil collectors Tom and Sharon Hurley. This is the eye. His right hand eye. Yeah, this is a really good ichthyosaur. I'm really pleased with what's coming out. And dinosaur Dick Souter. I'm claiming this to be an undescribed species. Uh, also claiming this next one up here to be an undescribed species. Uh, scientists won't agree with me yet. You haven't heard of these people before because fossil foot soldiers have little voice in the paleontology world. They do the hard yards while scientists get most of the glory. You just gotta chisel away, chisel away. There's the vert run. This is one of our best chances ever of finding a head. This looks like it was probably predated by a big, big animal, a chronosaur. This is a map of the, uh, of the last inland sea from 100 million years ago. Quite a mixed fauna in it, different types of marine reptiles, chronosaurs, long-necked plesiosaurs, short-necked uh, pliosaurs, ichthyosaurs and turtles. And this is the re reason why we're finding marine reptiles and also some dinosaur material in, in the marine outcropping. Fossil foot soldiers are the unsung heroes of paleontology, and in this film, they share their secrets, knowledge, and lifelong fascination with fossils. And in dry years, the ground opens with huge cracks, and in wet years, they just close again, and these rocks break up, and over the years, they work their way to the surface. That's how we find them. This one's already made it 150 mils up off of the slab already. This was the first truly great fish fossil that I'd ever found. We all have the same common ancestry of a fish with a head, a neck, front fins, a body, anal fins as the back legs and a tail. I've seen this desert wet before, but I've never seen water from horizon to horizon to horizon. This is mad. I've been a crook all my life. Just hasn't been caught. <laughs> Foot Soldiers of Paleontology